That leads me to the pearly gate And I know someday I'll reach that heavenly place Walking the way the way calls to rain In the Bible we are told Saul was on Damascus Road Seeking to destroy every Christian in the way heaven flashed around he heard a voice to the ground he fell as jesus spoke to him arise and do what i say so paul went walking on in god's way he went on walking the way the way called straight that leads me to the pearly gate and i know someday Walking the way, the way called straight. For so long I've traveled down this narrow road. Sometimes my way gets rocky, it's such a heavy load. But Jesus never promised us that there would be no pain. He just said that He'd go with us through the sun and through the rain. So I will not complain I'll keep walking the way The way called straight That leads me to the pearly gate And I know someday I'll reach that heavenly place Walking the way The way called straight straight that leads me to the pearly gate and I know someday I'll reach that heavenly place walking the way the way called straight I'll keep walking the way the way called straight I'll keep walking the way was Kurt Davis called uh, Walking the Way, and I'm Dave Rigg, and this is the Gospel Time program. During this half hour, it's going to be my privilege to bring to you the gospel of Jesus Christ in song. Now we listen to Greater Cause, and this is called Step On Over. You're listening to Gospel Time. Step, step on over, step, step, step on over, step, step on over to the other side. Step, step on over, step, step, step on over, step, step on over to the other side. Are you tired of living in sin? Are you tired of giving in? Well, here's what you can do. Just step on over, my God will save you. Step, step on over, step, step, step on over.
In the eighth chapter of Romans, verse 11, God's Word says, And if the Spirit of Him who raised Jesus from the dead is living in you, He who raised Christ from the dead will also give life to your mortal bodies through His Spirit who lives in you. Would you pause just a moment with me for a word of prayer? Our Holy Heavenly Father, we pause just a moment today to thank you so much for the gift of the Holy Spirit. Lord, to know that the power of the same Spirit who helped raise Jesus from the dead also lives in us, well, Lord, it just fills us with wonder and awe. Lord, you have chosen to live inside us, to bless us, mold us, develop us, and conform us to the goal of being like Jesus. Thank you, Lord. It's in Jesus' name we pray, and amen. I must tell Jesus all of my troubles. I cannot bear these burdens alone. In my distress, he kindly will help me. He ever loves and he cares for his own. I must tell Jesus all of my troubles. He is a kind compassionate friend If I but ask him he will deliver make up my troubles quickly and end I must tell Jesus Cannot bear these burdens alone. I must tell Jesus. I must tell Jesus. Jesus can help me. Jesus alone. Tempted and tried. great Savior, one who can help my burdens to bear. I must tell Jesus, I must tell Jesus, he all my cares and sorrows will share. to tell him all oh, all of my trials tell him all of my burdens every one of my cares I must tell Jesus I must tell Jesus Jesus can help We've been married long enough for the romance to have lost its, let's just say it's tired. Loving your husband really has nothing to do with him and everything to do with you and your walk with God. This is Elizabeth George for A Woman After God's Own Heart. 
The Bible calls love a fruit of the Holy Spirit. So why wouldn't it be the highest value for you to love your husband? I guarantee you it'll revive your marriage. Lavish love on him in the way you prepare a meal, in the encouragement you give, the prayers you say on his behalf. When you obey God, you'll have all the love in the world to give your husband. Walk by the Spirit and God will do the loving through you. Enjoy every minute God gives the two of you. This is Elizabeth George. Our next song is from Steve Warren. It's called I'm Gonna Walk. In this world we're living in, there's so much evil here within. Sometimes it seems we just can't find a way. But I found a man, I put my hand in his hand. He'll lead me on to that brand new day. Well, I want to walk with my Jesus, hand in hand, hand hand, side by side. side side. Well, I want to walk with my Jesus, evermore to abide through pain and sorrow and misery. Jesus, down those golden streets of home. Now that I have found the way, leads me to that brand new day. I'll not take a step without Jesus leading me. Oh, when that trumpet sounds, I know my feet will leave the ground. The next step I take will be on those golden streets. Well, I want to walk with my Jesus, hand in hand, side by side. Well, I want to walk with my Jesus, evermore to abide through pain and sorrow and misery. Down those golden streets of home Do you want to walk with my Jesus Hand in hand, side by side Do you want to walk with my Jesus Evermore Until faith in Christ was shown to us as the way of becoming right with God, we were guarded by the law. We were kept in protective custody, so to speak, until we could put our faith in the coming Savior. Let me put it another way. The law was our guardian and teacher to lead us until Christ came. So now, through faith in Christ, we are made right with God. But now that faith in Christ has come, we no longer need the law as our guardian. So you are all children of God through faith in Christ Jesus. And all who have been united with Christ in baptism have been made like him. There is no longer Jew or Gentile, slave or free, male or female, for you are all Christians. You are one in Christ Jesus. And now that you belong to Christ, you are the true children of Abraham. You are his heirs, and now all the promises God gave to him belong to you. Galatians chapter 3, verses 23 through 29, from the Holy Bible, New Living Translation. This is Gospel Time, a radio ministry. We depend upon your prayers and financial support to keep us on the air in your area and on your favorite radio station. If you'd like to help us, write to us at Gospel Time, Box 68, Bone Gap, Illinois, 62815. Write us today. Now on Gospel Time, it's hymn time. Jesus 
Jesus would I know more of his grace to others show more of his saving fullness see It sounded like a big something. What if it gets us before we get to the house? Oh, don't be so scared. There's nothing out here. What if there is? What are you so afraid of? Just like the woods at night, life can be scary. It can be dark and uncertain. And when things go bump in the night, you need someone to calm your fears. That someone is Jesus. He brings peace and tranquility to the scary times of life. And Psalm 121 will also bring great peace of mind. So don't be paralyzed by fear. 
Instead, let Psalm 121 stop your fear with peace. A thought from the pages of Our Daily Bread. And the music continues now with the Tribute Quartet. It's called When Those Gates Open Wide. I've been thinking about all this world has to give But there's nothing here that means that much to me Not in the light of the alternative I'd face If I turned and walked away from what I believe I want to be in that number I want to be the first inside To step on the streets of gold When those gates open wide I can't even imagine All the mystery heaven holds But I want to be there At the head of the line When those gates open wide Life is a race we run And heaven is our that finish line when we get home Behind those gates of pearl I want to see my Lord Oh, the majesty of God upon His throne I want to be in that number I want to be the first inside To step on the streets of gold When those gates open wide, I can't even imagine all the mystery heaven holds, but I want to be there at the head of the line when those gates open wide. I want to be in that number, I want to be the first inside, to step on the streets of gold, when those gates open wide, I can't even imagine. All the mystery heaven holds But I want to be there At the head of the line When those gates open wide I can't even imagine I can't even imagine All the mystery heaven holds But I want to be there At the head of the line When those gates open wide To illustrate the power of peer pressure, Amazing Allen will attempt to do a quadruple backflip reverse somersault into this swimming pool while holding a goldfish bowl. Are you sure this is safe, guys? Absolutely, Allen. All the real divers do it. Well, shouldn't there be water in the pool? Just dive into the goldfish bowl by putting it out in front of you. Shouldn't I at least have a bigger fish bowl? That's the size everyone on the Internet uses, Allen. Oh. And action! Uh, guys, this didn't work. Of course not, Alan. Was I supposed to learn something from this? Yes, we shouldn't let others pressure us into doing things we know we shouldn't do. But everyone likes me more. Right, guys? Uh, our focus should be on doing the right thing, Alan, not seeking the approval of others. There's gotta be a better way to make these points, guys. Another message from Lifeline Productions. Here's some bluegrass gospel music. And this is from the Primitive Quartet, and love came down. You're listening to Gospel Time. There was no way I could ever pay, so love came down at Christmas to a manger of pain. That holy day, and love came down. Wonderful 
shall be Well, that's all the time they're going to give us for today's Gospel Time program. A reminder that Gospel Time stays on the air in your area and on your favorite radio station because of your prayers and your financial support. If you'd like to help us, here is our mailing address. It's Gospel Time, Post Office Box 68, Bone Gap, that's B-O-N-E-G-A-P, Bone Gap, Illinois, and our zip code is 62815. Thanks for listening to our program today. Until our next radio broadcast, if the Lord's willing, this is Dave Rigg asking the Lord to richly bless you.